Hi everyone, it's me, Christoph from Logobox. This time I have something wonderful for you. It is quite a rare book, also very specific, and the colors and print quality of this book is amongst the prettiest I've ever seen. I know, it sounds very promising and I can assure you it definitely is, but let's just start with it, shall we? So this book it doesn't really show a lot uh, on the outside since there is a protective case that comes with it. So when we remove that we can see this very beautiful and minimalistic cover. You might already have noticed this logo here and you have guessed it right, this book is all about the car brand Opel. The title of this book is Zeiken der Zeit, or as we translate that to English, Signs of the Times. It is a book by Hans Henne Hoffmann and Drahu Kohout and was published in 1991 by Santis Verlag. So going through the book we can see the entire visual identity of Opel starting from 1862 as we can see here in the table of contents. You might also notice that the table of contents is split in two because this book is basically in two languages. So we get German and we get English. So flipping through the book we start with the Opel logo as we know it today a little bit of extra explanation about the company. And going through the book, we get this beautiful mark. I hope the camera can pick it up, but the gold is in Pantone colors, uh, Pantone metallic even, so there is a nice shine on most of these logos. Second there inside is as I said, an historic overview of the development and evolution of the Opel company, its visual identity and their products. And going through this book, we can just find absolute beauties. On every page there are absolute beauties like this one. Um, I, I'm even speechless going through this book. Every time I, I look at it and the work that is uh, featured in this book, it's just so beautiful. Um, also the colors, the usage of the Pantone colors, it's just beautiful. I hope the camera can pick this up because yeah, there's a slight shine to it. And this here, it's a design of the front grille of, uh, of the cars, you can't see it here, but it's um, yeah, the design of the grille that is on the front of the car. Uh, this was a design for yeah, one of their cars from 1907. So it's crazy to see how far back this book goes and how well documented it actually is, um, because finding work from back in those days, uh, it, it is definitely not the easiest thing to find and then the quality that um, is put into the reproduction of these logos everything is vectorized everything is as sharp as it can be so yeah the people who have made this book Hans Henner Hoffmann and Drauko they definitely put in a lot of work to make this book yeah, as pretty as it is right now. What I really like about this book is of course the evolution that you can see in the visual identity, but you can also see how their typography changed, the style they adapted. Um, here these works were from 1959, everything got a bit more robust uh, speaking in terms of design, it was more yeah, it was bolder, bigger letters, as you can see here, Opal, a nice crest that was created in comparison to work that was made in 1904, for example. Yeah, the style changed completely, but one thing remained, and that is the absolute beauty, the absolute um, quality of the work in every logo and every poster or yeah, just literally anything they made in terms of their visual identity. 
as you can see, this book is definitely a little gem in the world of logo books. It's also a little bit harder to find, so it's more on the rare side. I will not say that it's super rare, but in this condition, the pristine dust jacket, the inner pages that are great, there is no discoloration whatsoever, all pages are pure white. So this book is as new, basically, uh, and that for a book being published in 1991, it's definitely not easy to find them in this quality. The best news is that this book is for sale. You can get it on my webshop. I will put a link here down below in the description if you are interested in it. Take a look at it. There are, of course, also other books that I sell on my website. But this one, it is, yeah, it's a must have in my opinion, um, just because of the quality of the work and also the usage of Pantone colors, the metallic gold, the metallic silver, and the nice colors that are popping out. Yeah, this book for me really stands out in terms of quality and uh, print quality. So quality of the work, of course, and the print quality. It's definitely one of my favorites. That was the review of this book. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, feel free to leave a like to show your support. Have a great day and see you next time. Bye.